Howdy there. Uh, a couple days ago, I saw Jeff, who lives at home. Uh, and I enjoyed it. Uh, I'll give it a 7. I have no problems giving it a 7. Uh, it's about uh, Jeff, who's arrested development. Um, 30 years old, lives in his uh, mother's basement. Uh, basically, kind of lost... Uh, searches for signs literally from the universe um, to know what his destiny is um, and the film takes place all in one day I really like that um, and it's basically his journey as he uh, encounters his destiny um, stars Jason Siegel uh, Ed Helms Susan Sarandon uh, who else is in there? Uh, those are the big ones. Um, I can't remember the lady's name who plays Ed Helms' wife. Uh, she's from Adaptation, uh, Arrested Development, um, Descendants. Anyway, I can't remember her name. Uh, it was written and directed by Mark and Jay Duplass. Duplass? I'm not sure how to say their last name. I think this is their third, maybe fourth film. Um, they did Cyrus. This is their follow-up to Cyrus, the John C. Riley, Jonah Hill, uh, Arrested Development picture. Um, I enjoyed this more than Cyrus. I thought, uh, uh, although I did give Cyrus a seven as well, I believe. Um, I think this was just more enjoyable for me. Uh, Osiris was just <laughs> slightly disturbing for me, um, which is fine. Uh, I just had a better time watching this film. Um, it's really good. It's really funny. Uh, Susan Sarandon is great in it. Uh, I, you know, I can't remember the last time I've liked her as much. Probably uh, Igby Goes Down. She was great in Igby Goes Down. She's really good here. Uh, I guess the only problem I really had with it was it just seemed slightly uneven to me. Sometimes it, uh, you know, it would balance these like dramatic scenes with um, uh, weird like non sequiturs or, or one liners, um, or if they had a comedic scene that they would balance the comedic scene with like a moment of drama you know just right there in the scene and it uh, it was just kind of like uh, stopping and starting for me uh, you know like kind of like slamming on the brakes a little bit uh, but I really enjoyed it I I really identified with it really um, you know Jeff is very existential and his brother is not at all you know he's very literal uh, very goal driven um, very driven period uh, again we and this is all happening on one day which makes it seem like wow what a day but that's cool you know I enjoy those types of films um, I really don't know what else to say about it. I thought it was, uh, I mean, a definitely a vision from the Duplass brothers. They, they wrote and directed it. Um, produced, I, I can't, I don't think I remember them being producers, but, uh, you know, this is their story. I don't think they had to, you know, compromise too much to bring it up to a national level. Uh, I think it got a wider release than Cyrus did. Um, you know, the direction isn't, like, spectacular. Um, there, there's not much, like, flashy movements. It just basically is kind of like a fly-on-the-wall type directing, um, where you just are there observing. I just never, uh, you know, felt like I was a part of it or anything, uh, it's it's just and it's definitely not action packed, you know. It's it's a thinker, um, 
but you know there you know nothing too flashy uh, in terms of directing I mean it, it looked really good um, <laughs> you can tell that uh, you know that there was some elements of their life I feel to this story it feels very personal um, I you know I enjoyed uh, the references to signs the film uh, there were many times where I was laughing when no one else was laughing. Um, I just, I just really enjoyed it. I, again, I, I don't really know what else to say about it. Uh, just that I had a good time. Um, it wasn't spectacular, and it, it wasn't uh, definitely wasn't bad. So you know, it was a good flick. You know, a good flick. Uh, I definitely would give it a thumbs up if you're a fan of any of the names I've mentioned. Uh, you know, you'll definitely want to see it. Um, in terms of Ed Helms, I mean, uh, I guess this is a little bit different performance for him. I mean, he has to be a little bit more gung-ho than he usually is. Uh, but this is, I would say, still your typical Ed Helms performance. Again, same with Jason Siegel. Jason Siegel definitely doesn't really, you know, stretch his legs here too much. Uh, but Susan Sarandon's great. And the story is very clever. Um, there's a lot of honesty to it. Um, it you know, it just it is a good story. And it's not like a lot of uh, movies out there. So, uh, I mean, I, I could really identify with it. I could really identify with it. And I, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Um, I really don't know what else to say other than I had a good time at uh, Jeff, who lives at home. I give it a solid seven. Thank you very much.